Hello, I'm Oliver from Lux Training, and today we're going to be taking a closer look at the part of our dashboard that is designated to Training Central and Automated Analytics. So let's just jump right into it. What we are going to be looking at is their analyst views. It uses a combination of automated algorithms and an opinion from an analyst. Thanks to that, it makes a great second perspective on your trading. Our own asset management department has been using Trading Central and Anal Analytics ever since it, it released. At first, it used to be only available to Bloomberg users, but now we're finally able to bring it to our own clients as well. Now that we have our dashboard open, we can see that in the top right corner, we'll find a page TC Analytics. When we open that, now we see the page with analyst views. On the left side, we can see the different currency pairs. And on the right side, we see a description of every pair. So let's start with what are our options. We can look at Forex, indices, or commodities. Um, I'm a Forex trader, so I'll look at Forex. And then we have a couple options to choose from. One is what kind of ideas do we want to see? Are you a major Forex trader? Do you trade exotics? Or then we have the less common pairs. Yes, you also get to choose, are you an intraday trader? Um, so you would pick intraday. If you're a daily trader, you would go daily or weekly. Uh, depends if you trade intraday or if you're a swing trader. If you have a preference for bullish or bearish trends, you can also search by that. So if we take a look at the left hand side, we can pick a currency pair, let's pick Euro GBP. On the right side, the first thing we see the chart. This chart is from 12.14 p.m. We see that the preference of trading central is trending downwards. That's what the blue arrow indicates for us. Another important part that we see on the chart is the blue pivot line, which basically tells us where does the preference of trading central swap? If the price action stays under the blue line, under the pivot line, the trading central's preference is trending downward. And if the price action moves over the blue line, we would look at the alternative scenario. So above 0.8608, we would look then for our profit targets to be 0.8. 626 or 0.8637 so an idea for a trade could be we would place our stop loss above the blue pivot line since that's where the trade would become invalid and we would place our profit targets before the red lines which are at the moment our resistances down here we see supports and resistances the more asterisks the support our resistance has the bigger strength of it uh, we can take a look at one more let's see for example bitcoin and dollar there we see in the preferences rising uh, the pivot point is 581.5 and a trade idea would be it is pretty simple you can also have the supports resistances and pivot levels put in your mt4 which i will show you in a different video but for now and that is it for me it's pretty simple on how to use this page in our dashboard analyst views from trading central and if you have any other questions feel free to reach out on our live chat we are there for 24 7 or write us an email at info at and for now goodbye